Like this video and subscribe in the next 5 seconds or this spider will be crawling around in your bed when you sleep tonight. Today we will be taking a look at the most expensive things YouTubers have destroyed in videos. Let's get straight into the video with this first clip, Jake Paul destroys a real Ferrari. I'm sure all of you guys know who Jake Paul is, he's one of the biggest YouTubers with over 20 million subscribers and he ends up destroying a real Ferrari for a video. I know it sounds insane but in this first part he starts off lightly and then the second part he goes absolutely insane and completely ruins this Ferrari. Check this out. If you lose, I'm breaking it. If you win, I'm not breaking it. Hold, hold my, hold my breaking to <laughs> Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. <laughs> that was scissors. <laughs> no, 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 you won't, you won't, you won't. I didn't think he was going to do it. Oh, we're still I have yeah. to tell them how you really feel. Yeah. Because he'll probably pay for it. So. No, I'm going to pay for it. Yeah. Okay. It's just a windshield, you know what I mean? Yeah. Well, you got the Ferrari merch on. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I feel bad for you. But you know what? Like I said earlier, if you want to leave Team 10, if anyone wants to leave, now's the 10th. <laughs> 2,000 years later. Yo, you won't. Please don't. <laughs> I <laughs> well, we might as well finish off the Ferrari windshield. Oh. Nobody move. <laughs> Why? Why? <laughs> oh, is it, it's really getting dark now. The Italians build those. Okay, Jake Paulers, I will see you tomorrow. Morgs destroys very expensive things. Next up, you have the huge YouTuber Morgs, but don't go anywhere because you have more huge YouTubers coming up next. Morgs has over 11 million subscribers and he ends up throwing darts at a dartboard and destroying whatever the dart lands on. On the dartboard are like TVs, Xboxes, PS5s, very expensive items and he ends up destroying so many expensive things. Keep watching to see what he destroys. Bring a dart islands for my TV. Mr. Beast destroys his friend's expensive cars and surprises them with brand new ones. Now up next is one of the biggest YouTubers and most popular YouTubers ever and you probably know that he's done a lot of crazy things for videos in the past but in this clip he destroys two of his friend's cars with massive meteors and then surprises them both with brand new cars. Watch till the end to see the friend's reactions, it's so unbelievable but now he's going to take his friends to a car dealership and buy them brand new cars and this is just incredible. Let's check it out. As I already know, this is that condition. The window work fast it doesn't leak oil and pie destroys his priceless 100 million subscriber youtube play button now pewdiepie is the biggest youtuber on the planet and he was given a special award by youtube for reaching 100 million subscribers and there's only two of these in the world this is worth so much money and he breaks it by accident in a video keep watching to see how he does this in the post hmm what is this <laughs> i like the color scheme youtube very nice it even got a letter from Susan. I won't read the whole thing, but it finishes with congratulations again on becoming Marcia's husband. And please give Sven a big hug from us. Thank you, Susan. <laughs> but here it is. Oh! Uh, ah! Let me get this out of the way. Oh my God, I've smudged it already. ba -da! <laughs> PewDiePie, congratulations on passing 100 million subscribers. I know a lot of people wanted a custom re reward, but I don't care. This is awesome. So here's the part where something tragic happens to his ruby play button. The ruby part actually falls out and smashes onto the floor. This is hard to watch. My offer to make you a custom 100 mil award still stands. All you have to do is say, yes, Mr. Pie. <laughs> Did I just say it? Oh my God. I mean, I'd be honored. Bobby Dukes is the one that made, uh, I think, the downvote play button. You know, I'm proud of this. <laughs> Sniper Wolf destroys a $100,000 car. So one day, Sniper Wolf was out driving in her car at night when a drunk driver crashes into the back of her, and this completely ruins her car. It was a very bad crash, and honestly, Sniper Wolf is very lucky to be alive today. I got into a car crash. I'm actually very fortunate that I am still here and able to make this video. My car was not so fortunate. But anyways, I'll tell you guys the whole story about what happened. We actually got hit by a drunk driver. I had my seatbelt on. I probably would have died if I didn't have my seatbelt on. I know I would have like flew out the window or something. This guy just crashed us at a light. He's still in the car. So that was her explaining the situation and now she's going to show more of a damaged car and just how lucky she actually is. This could have easily been a lot worse. Keep watching. Airbags deployed, drunk driving. 
Sausage got out of the car too, he called 911 and I was talking to my mom at the time and she was asking me, are you okay? What happened? I told her everything and she was like, go to the hospital if you need to go to the hospital. I really didn't want to go to the hospital even though my neck and my back really hurt. It didn't hurt so much at first, but then like after an hour or two passed, like my neck and back really started to feel stiff. And now we have It's Funny and her and the crew end up losing something very expensive. They were in New York in a hotel when Draco actually lost his $30,000 ring in a ball pit and they searched for hours to find it. Keep watching to see this. <laughs> Don't save yourself. <laughs> okay guys, story time. So I was in the ball pit. I was so happy. I was like, yay, ball pit. So I was throwing balls at Zach in the ball pit when my Gucci ring slipped off my finger and fell right into the ball pit. And I was like, I saw it slowly sinking and I was like, eh, it's gonna be done forever. But luckily, we found the Gucci ring and it is safe, guys. The Gucci's safe. Anyways, that's the story of how I lo almost lost my very expensive Gucci ring. Make sure to leave a like and click on one of the videos on the screen and I'll see you all in my next video. Have a great day.